Hey folks, this is Red Jake Mendes. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Linux Mint into your PC. Once you are booted up from a USB or CD containing the Linux Mint image, you will get a screen like this. Now select Start Linux Mint and press Enter. As you can see, this is a live session of Linux Mint. You could check out its features, uh, what's new in it, etc. Now to start the installation, click on Install Linux Mint. So let's get started. First, uh, select the language. I'm selecting English. These are the prerequisites for installing Linux Mint. If you have an active internet connection, you could uh, download the updates of Linux Mint. There are two options here. One is Erase Disk and Install Linux Mint and second one is something else. If you click on Erase Disk and Install Linux Mint, uh, Linux Mint would automatically create partitions for you. It would use the entire hard disk for installing Linux Mint. And the disadvantage is you will not be able to install any other operating system side by side with the Linux Mint because the entire hard disk is being used up. The second option is something else. If you select something else, you can create your own partitions and the advantage is you will be able to install other operating systems side by side with Linux Mint. Right now I am selecting something else. This is where you will create your partition layout. For uh, Linux Mint, the three essential partitions are the slash partition, the boot partition and the swap area. First of all, I am creating the boot partition click on the free space and select add click add under mount point specify it as slash boot ext4 file system the partition size will be between 100 to 500 mp I am giving 200 mp the boot partition is being created the next partition I am going to create is a swap area under use as select swap area the size of swap uh, I'm giving is uh, 1 GB and uh, the final partition I'm going to create is slash partition I'm giving the rest of the space for slash partition I'm giving the mount point as slash slash partition is being created. Slash is where you store your files, pictures, music, etc. If you want, you could further add any other operating systems provided you have free space. Now, if you click on install now, the partitions you specified in the partition table are going to be created. You cannot make any changes after you click install now. I'm clicking install now. partitions you mentioned in the partition table are being created here now select your time zone select your keyboard layout I'm selecting the default one this is where you'll create your main user the administrator I give it a name It's a username and I'm giving a password. Now you could select two options. One is login automatically or require my password to login. So the installation is going on. This would take some time. the installation is successfully finished now if you want to continue testing click this and I am restarting my system Linux Mint is successfully booted up now I am logging into this user so here it is Linux Mint I hope you enjoyed watching my video thanks for watching